Manye iti izi. Uh, let's look at question number eight. Number eight, it's a flow plan. When you look at the flow plan, actually a flow plan is a layout of how a house will look like in the future. All right? It shows where the kitchen will be, the bedroom, toilet, a living room, the, you know, the garage, if there is a garage, what's there, you know, that's a flow plan. It's a flow plan, a major layout of. All right. RDP houses are built to assist low-income earners. RDP houses are built to assist low-income earners. RDP houses eh, are built to assist low-income earners. Who, sorry, with proper houses. Mr. Nyandeni visited Urudiwai uh, Unit L to check the progress of the construction of, of his parents' home. The floor plan of the house. Now, this, this is how the house will look like. All right. That's how the house will look like. Take note, we have a compass there. These are measurements. These measurements are in millimeters. Okay. Determine the number of interior doors shown on the floor plan. Interior, those that are inside. So we shall start by saying, start by interior doors. Interior doors, we have one, two, and three. One, two, and three. RDP houses are built to assist low income earners with proper houses. Mr. Ninyandin visited one of the units to check on the progress of the construction of his parents' house. A floor plan. What's a floor plan? A floor plan, we always say it's a layout of how a house will look like. All right, probably it might have a compass. Some others have skills, depending on which kind of floor plan is given to you. So we have measurements. These are measurements that we see on top. These ones here but they're in many meters all right we look at the question number one question number one says determine the number of interior doors determine the number of interior doors that are shown on the floor plan interior simply meaning the ones which are inside so we have one that's inside two and three so we have three interior doors so here we have three We have three doors. Give the general direction of the bed, of bedroom one from the living room, Me meaning you're in the living room, you're going to bedroom one, living room two, bedroom one. Yes, this is our campus. The campus has north, so this is west, south, and east. So if you're uh, bedroom one from the living room, that means if you're in the living room, where is bedroom one? So bedroom one is in the northeast. Our general direction here is north, northeast. Name the room that has the same floor plan as bedroom two. The same floor area, sorry. Same floor area as bedroom two. Let's come here. <clears throat> bedroom two is 3,550. These are millimeters. What about this side here from here to the, what's the bedroom? Let's go and you see. Oh, it's the same. It's the same. 3,550. So this is bedroom two. So we are looking for a room that has the same measurements as this. Same measurements. Let's come. We shall start with bedroom. Living room. Yes, living room. Yes, it has this much. Robert, from there to here. What is it? We check up. Oh, it's the same story. So one of the rooms, we can say living room. Let's see. Uh, the kitchen, no. This number is different. Bedroom two. This number is different from this. So the living room shares the same area as bedroom two. Living. Give the names of the rooms of 
uh, names of the rooms that are facing west. In other words, those ones that are on the western side. On the west, we said this is west. So if you draw a compass in bit here, <laughs> you draw the compass in between the house. So which one is on the west? These are the rooms. We have the kitchen, the toilet, and the living room. We shall say, we said we have the kitchen. We have the bathroom, call it the toilet. And we have the living, the living room. Eighty-two, sorry, eight point two. Study the sitting plan of a, a, a airplane below. Study the sitting plan of the airplane below that is going to be used by Kubeka, Kubeka's family, when traveling from Durban to Houghton. Sitting plan of the airplane. It's this one here. <coughs> define, define, define. The sitting plan. So here we shall say sitting plan. Is the. Rowing. Show. Sit. In. The Showing sits in the airplane, you know, that drawing showing. You can say it shows the sitting arrangement of how people are going to sit. How many exit doors are indicated on the sitting plan? Now, unfortunately, we don't see any symbol to show, but the exit doors we have, we have one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, and eight. So we have eight exit doors. Eight. Exit doors. Write down the number of passenger seats in the plane. Oh. So here we go. Number of passenger seats in the plane. Now, what do what you got? This was just showing you that uh, this is column A, B, C, D, E, A. But still, these are seats. Né? So we're going to count. We shall see. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So that's 9 times 3 plus <coughs> 9 again times what? 3. This is the first class here. Then we can count these ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, plus six, plus, let's count. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. So it's eighteen times three times two. We are going to add up all the seats now. So nine times three times two. We have fifty-four. Fifty-four plus plus the six plus eighteen times three times two. So this is 60 plus that is 168 seats. One sixty-eight seats. Sixty-eight seats. All right. Eight point two point four, the actual length of the airplane. <clears throat> actual length of the airplane from the cockpit to the passenger cabin is even as below, as sorry, as 50 meters. 
So the scale of the plan is one is two hundred. Okay, the length of the plate on the plan. Plan. This is what paper. Then actual. The moment you hear the actual, this is in what in real. In real life, so we pull out the scale, which is one is to two hundred. The left is on paper, and the right is in it, real life. So in real life, this plane is 50 meters. What is it on paper? A, you remember on paper, we should all have many meters or centimeters. These are meters. We are going to cross multiply. Cross multiply 200 times A. You get 200A equals 1 times 50. Remember, remember these are meters. So since we're looking for the value of A, we divide through by 200. Divide through by... 200. So the A equals to 0.25. These are meters. Change them to millimeters. Apply by 1,000. The answer becomes 251 millimeters. If you wanted them to become centimeters, it would be 25 centimeters. Mr. Kubeka's son has been allowed to see it, has been allocated a seat in the eighth row, second column. Uh, from the left, name the seat number he will be seated. So they have told us eighth. A row, second column. So these are columns. When we go down, these are columns. Then these are the rows. So we are in row number eight, second column. So it's supposed to be here, which is what? B8. You see? So the city number is B8 on the left. That's what they say. So it's B. On the left, from the left, Mr. Kubeka's wife wants to sit in any seat next to the window. Mention one reason why she chooses to sit next to the window. One, people like it when eh? it's to view, eh? to view what. To have a clear, clear view. Others may sit there in case of emergency, they can easily escape. All right. Give one possible reason why Mr. Kubek has decided to use airplane tra uh, to travel to Haute. Advantages of using an uh, airplane. Hello, plane. Supposed to be one, it's fast, two, it's convenient, it's convenient, very comfortability. Among other reasons, ne? you pick one. Why would you use a plane over a bus? The family left King Shaha Airport at 9.30 and arrived at Oaratambo at 10.40. Take at the average speed the airplane was traveling at if the flight distance was 478 kilometers. One, we need to know how much time was because we are going to calculate speed. And remember, speed equals to distance over time. We already have the distance. It's this much. What we don't have, it's what? the time. So time will equal to the duration they spent, which is the end time minus the start time. The end time they ended or they re arrived at 1040 minus 9 
and that this is one hour and ten minutes one hour ten minutes so we change everything to hours so one hour plus ten over sixty what do you end up having you have one comma one six 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 recurring i will leave it like that so these are the hours they use this is the time so here we go so speed now we have the distance divided by one comma one six seven as our time The speed of the airplane 